Hey there, today I'm going to show you how to use Google Fonts with the WP Astra theme. So the first thing you need to do is you need to make sure that the Google Fonts option is enabled. So to do that, we come down to Astra Options. And down here, you just need to make sure that the typography option is activated. Now on this website it's already activated as you can see. So now we can go to here, we can go to customize fonts or an easier way to do it is to just go to customize or not easier, it's the same thing then once you're in the customizer it'll take you to uh, the, the front end of the website so what you can then do is you can go to global and typography and then you've got the option to adjust the headings and the base typography so this here is a heading and this here is the base typography. So, if, for example, if we want to adjust the base typography, this will adjust the base font size. So you'll see it increase from 15 to 16 pixels. So we'll take that down. And we can also adjust the font that's used. So the Astra theme comes by default with all of the Google fonts installed as well as the system fonts. And you can also add custom fonts as well. And I'll link up a video in how to do that. So you just choose another font if you want and it will, yep, so you see there it's adjusted the body font. Obviously that font looks terrible, <laughs> so I'd be surprised that I don't, that would only really work in some sort of sci-fi kind of theme. Um, you can do a lot with it as well. You can adjust the line height as well. Um, you can adjust the amount of spacing that each paragraph has. You can adjust the font weight. So the font weight is how thick the font is, so I'll change it to semi-bold. I should mention that you'd almost never use a semi-bold font for a um, body font face or you can change the text transform is whether it's uppercase, lowercase and then if you want to adjust the headings you do that here so this this covers all of the headings but then you can also adjust each heading so heading 1, heading 2, heading 3, heading 4 etc you can adjust it from here so you can reduce the sizes, text transform, everything that we could do with the last option and then when you're done, click publish and that's all there is to it.